All right, guys, here we are. We're looking at canopy mold serial number three. And we're gonna try and pop it off. Well, that's a good sign. This is the uh, weather stripping I had used. Oh, that's just tape. Yeah, never mind. Ah, there we go. So you can see this sheet that that's coming off. This this is good. This is um, it's gray in color right now, but this is uh, this is the primer that was laying on top of the PVA, and you want the PVA to release and allow this thing to just fall off. So that's a good sign. Well, it's not just going to fall off. They just fall off. We get, we get, we get spoiled. I can hear some little popping noises in here as the air was going in, which is good. That's hopefully the PVA uh, releasing from the fuse.
looks kind of messy on the inside, but that's the PVA. A nice layer of PVA on there, and that's releasing nicely. All right, that looks pretty good. I can see one imperfection here that was actually, uh, I think I overheated um, the, the canopy a little bit when I was force drying it yesterday. And, you know, you gotta remember that the underneath all of this is foam. And, um, uh, and maybe I didn't remember that, but, there's a little indentation over on this side of the, of the canopy. So there's a high spot right here in the canopy. I'm not gonna worry about that. Um, and I'm not gonna try and fix it in this female mold. Instead, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and set up uh, to pour uh, the male, the male master in, um, and I'll do that with uh, UltraCal. And then when that comes out of the mold, I'll end up with a low spot in that. And I'll fill and fix that prior to uh, doing the vacuum forming. But overall, this looks, this looks fantastic. Hang on. So you can see right here, this indented area, this is where the tape was uh, and it's protecting this groove and, and that's okay because the, the actual usable part of the canopy starts right about here. This part right here just makes the whole pouring of the final mold a little bit easier. Same thing here. This is, uh, oh, that's actually PVA, but um, this is where the tape was. But the inside of this mold looks, well, initially it looks perfect. Um, but I'll take a much harder look at it. And anyway, that's how you get a mold off of a plug. Uh, when everything goes right anyway. Later.